and welcome back to another one of my vlogs. So it's Saturday and I I washed my hair. It's literally 20 to 4 in the afternoon. It's not been a great day for me. I'm not going to lie. Um, and if you're my friends and you know me, you know exactly what I'm on about. Um, my mental health has not been fantastic, which I'm going to talk about in this vlog because I haven't really touched on it in a very long time. So... You know, there's been things recently that have triggered it and also just myself and my self-care just hasn't been what it should be. So today I need to pack away some things. I need to try and go into town. I don't know whether I'm going to be able to now because tomorrow there's like a massive storm and I'm not going out in that. Not a chance in hell. Um, Not by, by foot anyway. Um, So yeah. And I need to go to Poundland and I want to get the Mario Badescu, if that's even how you pronounce it, drawing lotion. Because as you can see, in between my eyebrows, I've got a very nice friend that's come to join me. Um, so yeah, my spots haven't got too, as bad as they have been, but I do not want to let them get hold. So and I've heard great things about the Mario Badescu skincare range. So yeah, um, but I'm currently in my dressing gown and in my hair turban because you know what? It's just been one of them days. Um, and yeah, so I'm going to touch on a lot of those sort of things later. I've got a movie night with mum. Um, so yeah, but I really need to try and get to the pound shop. Don't know whether I will. But if I do, I'll show you and I'll do a haul. I'm about to take another two ibuprofen tablets because I've also come on um, my time of the month. So that hasn't really been helping my mental health either. Um, so yeah, but I'm going to take two of these because oh, this has been helping me just about survive the week. Breaking waitros. I know. Oh. Mango, Mango. So we're gonna eat those. Yes. Yeah, so really the the Didn't even know they did these until I went to you know the Arlo's shop. Yeah. Yeah. Come in there. I love this eye. I'll try do? a small one because uh, just it might case, yeah. it upsets our skin. So um, I don't want to do that. No, but I love this aisle. Washing powder and fabric conditioner. Shall I tell you why? Why? It smells amazing. Introduce me to these and these with Dairy Lee. Or like soft cheese, it's absolutely yeah, amazing. Well. Yeah, exactly, that's what I mean. So and one of my favourite other aisles as well. It's dangerous. They don't have any cheese straws. Cheese nibbles. Where? Oh we've got them. Get those? Yes, please. The ones, they're cheese. No, the yeah. It's cheaper. Oh, I remember these from holiday, like years and years and years ago. So I um, know they are really good, but I'm gonna need them. They really look nice. Love dunking these in tea. They're amazing. I do love them a lot. Anyone wonder what my favourite cereal is? It's Kellogg's Crunchy Nut Clusters or at my boyfriend's. It's crazy. Our trolley is just filling itself up and filling itself up. It's a bit bad, but. Um, I said our trolley is just filling itself up. I know, I've got to carry this on as well, yeah? Yeah, that'd be fine. Do you need to go to Wix, don't you? I do, yes. 
adult stuff adult stuff yes. adult stuff um but yeah so i know courtney loves my food halls and i know so many people have said they like them so yeah that is the plan but i've got some healthy things don't we really i got fruit i might try that oh they look nice Porridge. you need some smoothie don't you oh there is so many people is that the smoothie you get? Because these smoothies do look really good. That looks a bit watery. This is nice. This is just raspberry. Oh, yeah, that's like the thicker uh, one, isn't it? Yeah. How much are they? It's 185. Does it taste nice? I love it, but it helps to take my tablet. Don't they? They do. I was saying I need to get these because I prefer them in this ones because this, look, they don't have much. So they're not really worth the. Um, Oh. I'm not a massive cheesecake eater to be honest. Really not. No. That's literally the last one. Yeah. I was freaking out. I didn't think they had one. I might get cute in there. All the bags we put in here, otherwise I think we'd have more space to fill. Oh, we're sharing them. Okay, Alright. Red rolls, yours. Oh. And the rocky. There we go. Now it's me. home oh my hands are so sore and so red they're so cold oh, that's all right um but i've got literally bags from wait i bought a new bag from my trays this one no this one and um, they're the same um because they are really good i've got loads of stuff from Poundland, but i'm just gonna show you the bits i bought from waitrose first so as i mentioned in the store um i absolutely <laughs> it is um, but yeah, so I got, I've learned about these from my work and they are so nice and especially with soft cheese, they're delicious. So yeah, I'm very happy with them. And then everything else in there is pound shop. So it's that, so I'll show you that when I'm in my room or in here. I don't know yet. Mum got some of these. We've got some bread rolls. These are my ones. So we've got a cheese one and a tiger roll. And mum got like a healthy looking one. A oh, cheese one. one. Yeah. Mum's got some jumbo oats. Can eat some porridge and hello. Vanish. This is because I really don't have enough crisps. Thing is, though, I. Because that's just. That was from the pound shop, wasn't it? But yeah. Sensations for my walkers are really nice. I just don't like pop it on mango and red chili. That's the only reason I actually went out. Yeah. And this is really nice, apparently. So, and the strawberries. There's some grapes. Grapes. And that's it for me. And that's it. Oh. Right. So, oh no, you have got some bits in here. You've got your oh, yes. sun bites. Oh, yes. You've got. I haven't got the milk either, haven't I? Oh, yeah. Mini piss. Oh, mini. Oh, Excuse me. No, thank you. Mini pots, I meant. Yes, with mini um, pots. Oh, not mini bits. <laughs> Trust um, me, it doesn't taste like that. <laughs> you've got whole milk. We've got, this, <gasps> we've got this for tonight because basically my granddad used to have having red wine and cheese. So we've got a bottle of red wine there and we're going to have half yeah. of. We're going to have half of this each. Well, half of the bottle, I think he'd blow me. Uh, well, tonight we're not. Well. You never know. If you say so. Um, Mum got herself <gasps> yes. these. Very naughty. Valentine's edition. Not for that reason. Um, this is mine to go in the freezer because it's three for seven pounds on m and Ready News. Um, this is mine for tonight. I'll put it Chicken in the and mushrooms. Or I might have that Monday. Okay. Yeah. And then this is Mum's. Chicken and bacon pasta bake. Um, that's else? your bag done. That's that one. Um... This is mine that I've got from my trays. Yeah, I'm just getting that. Um, so that's my meringues, a bit battered. But this is the last one. Honestly, I started freaking out. I don't think they had it anymore. I was like, what? Um, I got a chocolate mousse because they didn't have profiteroles in M&S. Finally got myself some Greek style honey yogurt, thick and creamy, with some tablet strawberries and a meringue nest. Lovely. Uh, yes. And um, these, which I didn't know they did until like when I went to my local petrol station. Oh my god, they taste amazing. Mm -hmm. I left my old bag open and they tasted like crap. Um, got some ginger nut essential waitrose biscuits because they taste amazing and with a cup of tea, lovely. And then my mum spotted these because they didn't have any cheese twists. They are the crisp and tasty all butter cheddar nibbles and they look really, really nice. So, and you, oh, mum, you can put these in the oven. 
What's that? The cheese nibbles. Ready? Yeah. So I got a pack of the large bubble mailers. Just to send off there's three in this pack. Um, and these are from the pound shop. All of this is from the pound shop, by the way. Um, and these are really, really good. And I also got a pack of the smaller ones. And these have six in them. Um, I do probably need more packs of the bigger ones. But I just thought I'd get one pack for now. Um, sorry. Um, I've got, because I'm going to redo my cork board and just cover them in like prints. So then when I film by my bed, because there's more room to film there, especially when I do like makeup looks and stuff, then the background looks nice. So they've got all of these prints. I love that. Rose all day and I ain't your hun, hun. I'm trying to mix this like sizes. I've got these ones. I love black and white prints. Look, mum. They've got like an alpaca sort of thing and a giraffe and then leaf prints. What are they then? And they're like prints so you can put them in frames and stuff. Oh, okay. But I'm gonna put them on my cork board, like cover my cork board in different size prints. Yeah. You've got rose all day, oh, cactuses. Nice. And then these, this one, which is follow your dreams. The best is yet to come, let the adventure begin. And this really nice sort of like leaf print one that I don't know what it says, stay wild. Lovely. Um, and really then, pardon? Don't get too dangerous, that's not happening anymore. What, staying wild? Yeah. <laughs> Um, I also got some parcel tape just because this is stronger and I don't actually have any of this. So, and I've got plenty of giveaways coming up that I haven't already if I haven't already done them um, by the time you well, see I'm this. Going on to weeks now, okay, uh, have fun. Um, so I got this bag and this is not for me. Um, I'm pretty sure the person will guess who this is for considering what house it is. But the pound shop had all the houses for the Harry Potter bags and I was like, yeah, go on then. I'll get that. Um, I've got some more of the sun bites because these taste amazing. Yes, please. Um, they taste amazing and I absolutely love them. Um, I have been thinking about Terry's chocolate orange for some reason for a long time and I've just wanted a Terry's chocolate orange, but I didn't know they did bars. So I was like, I'll have one of them. Yeah, thank you. I love chocolate orange and orange chocolate is just great. As you can see, because I've got some more club oranges because they're really good. Got wagon wheels now if you know me then you know i love the film wild child it's just one of my favorite sort of like chick flicks and this is where i learned about wagon wheels from so yeah and then beauty wise oh no i've still got one more food bit um more chocolate orange <laughs> quality street matchmakers they taste banging um so beauty wise i got myself this because on facebook chats and stuff like that i see so much about the hand masks and feet masks and my hands i get them really dry and horrible and i really love the hand cream from the body shop but i love the idea of a hand mask so you know test this suitable for all skin types apparently their gloves um, and hopefully they'll do the trick this put in a giveaway it's a technic lip kit and these were the only the only color they did but it's in ladybird it's a really nice, nice matte red color so i got that i got this for myself because it looks like a nude color um it's a w7 lips um tinted lip oil i love lip oils i find them amazing so i got this color for myself i'll open it up later and then i got this one so it's tinted kiss tinted nourishing lip oil i got this one for a giveaway and then i got this i don't know what the hell this is um it looks like it's a lip powder it's a metallic it it's not for me it's to put in a giveaway because it looks quite cool but it's, a, it's in a bit but it's like a metallic lip kit so i was like yeah i'll get that for a giveaway um so yeah i'm gonna keep um all the sort of like poundland things that i get for giveaways in the packaging even if it's not for my poundland giveaway which these aren't um but i just want to keep them in the packaging so i know that they're still obviously sealed and in condition and the maybelline one is completely like taped up but just sort of like creative people would be quite cool um but i'm very excited to try mine uh, so as i've previously mentioned in my videos before and vlogs and stuff when i've shown you these i mentioned to mum that obviously i still had them in my cupboard and she turned around and said that she'd love to do these together as in like cook them together especially this one um and i'd really like us to do one of these too because we both like our smoothies um so yeah and i was thinking to make videos out of them or to incorporate them to vlogs like baking with mum because i could see it being very very funny i'm not going to lie um and also i've still got this which let me check the date oh i can still use okay right so i'm either gonna do this tomorrow um, and tomorrow's vlog or at some point soon in a video because i want to use it and also i want to test whether they're actually like good because i know so many people buy this kind of thing so yeah, I don't know what inspired me to buy this, to be honest. But I think it'd be worth a go. So I've packed everything, literally my cupboard. I don't know what I did before I had my own cupboard. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, but I've shifted everything around. I've got my Love Island bottle. Um, I still love that. I haven't been... I'm going to talk about Love Island in a bit. Because to be honest, I don't know. 
I've got mixed feelings, but I've still got my cups there, but obviously all my food is now wrapped in my hotel chocolate, chocolate, sweet stuff and savoury, breakfast things, um, porridge, milkshake powder, my Cadbury spread, which I need to try. Honey, which I'm going to put on porridge, because uh, that's what my granddad used to do, as well as syrup, but honey's a bit better for you. Um, and I've still got my go-ahead bars. I've got my tins, because we're going to shop, quick foods and stuff like that. And then up here is where I put my cracker breads, my ginger nut biscuits, my crackers, for my soft cheese, and my meringue nests. So, yeah, but I'm really liking my cupboard. I love it when it's full. Not going to lie to you. just swatched it. It's not the colour that I thought it was going to be. However, I don't really like rose-scented things. This smells delicious. Um, it's an English rose, and I think it smells really, really nice. It's just got like a nice sheen tint, and it's not a thick oil like it's. Because I have tried some lip oils, believe it or not, that are very thick and greasy, and this does not feel either of those things. Oh, I cannot wait to use it. Now, me and Malika are going to be doing like a birthday swap, um, because you know we didn't do it last year. Um, so what did we do it last year? I can't remember, but we're doing a birthday swap and a Christmas swap this year. Um, and I've already seen some things I've picked up for like giveaways and stuff that I want to get her, but I want to also include them in giveaways, so I'm going to buy them again. Because um, we do do each other a wish list. My hair in the bin is a nightmare. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to rebuy some stuff at the end of the month and just start getting like a couple of little bits so then it's not all in one go. Um, so yeah, but I'm very happy. I'm getting a bit happier. I'm not going to lie. Very happy actually, maybe stretching it a bit, but. I'm getting there. I also bought from the pound shop some lighters because I find them so much easier to light candles. So this one is a Primark one, Victoria Meredith Blueberry Muffin. And it smells quite nice, I'm not gonna lie. So I'm gonna light that. Um, but these lighters are jet lighters. So they're like windproof and they are windproof, I can tell you that. I bought this because they're mo so much easier to use than matches. There we go. Easier to do it off camera. Right, so we're going to watch this movie first, for sure. So good if you have not watched this and you're a Marvel fan. Where have you been? You need to, I'm going to get myself a little bit more cocoa. We've got quite a few of the Marvel films, as you can see. We're a Marvel-loving family. Um, found it, never mind. Oh, also a very good movie, which we're hopefully going to watch afterwards. So this is my dinner. I know Risotto never tends to look that advertising, but I cannot wait to eat it. Oh my god, it's got my favourite things in it: chicken and mushrooms. Um, and we've got spider burn on, and it's really, really good. So, yeah. I'm wiping away the tears because I've just ended my vlog that marks for three years of my granddad passing away. Because I went out with my grandma and everything. You would have seen that before you see this vlog. But it's gone past twelve. I'm going to go to bed in a minute. But yeah, I just wanted to end that vlog so I can edit it so I can try and get it up before the power cut potentially happens. So yeah, but um, the Marvel movies was amazing. Dinner was amazing. The red wine was lovely, but my head's just a bit fuzzy now, but it's all good. Um, my birch box has arrived at my grandma's, a Valentine's edition. My mum's gonna pick, up, um, pick it up on Monday. I'm gonna film it on Monday and hopefully get it up on Tuesday because I wanna get it up as soon as possible. Cause I'm really, really excited for it. And there's gonna be another box I'm gonna keep cause it's a limited edition 2020 Valentine's packaging. So I'm very excited for that. But basically, yeah, say yesterday because today is now Sunday while I'm filming this because it's like, what time is it now? It's nearly 20 past 12. So Saturday um, was not a very good day for me. Like my mental health has been playing up. It's not been fantastic. Obviously it was a lead up to my granddad's three year anniversary. And then after that I was getting a bit better and then I just went downhill again. Um, Cause I'm not good at coping with things at the moment. And I'm gonna be getting help for that because I can't carry on like this. I found a job that I really, really love and I'm so grateful for. And I don't wanna mess that up. Um, also, I um, obviously have my family that I'm so grateful for. I've got my boyfriend, I've got my friends, like I've got so much to be grateful for, so much to be thankful for. And I need to stop letting my head ruin things because that's what it's starting to do or it feels like it's starting to do. I'm going to take this off because I'm so hot. I was really cold on the sofa when I was watching the movies, but this is the Anastasia merch from ages ago. It says stay classy and I think that's supposed to say stay classy in another language. Not too sure which one. Um, 
but yeah so I had a very slow start to the day I had a really crap start to the day like all I did was like cry and have like I had two panic attacks as well so you know fun times but I am going to seek some help I'm going to be talking about it in my life update get ready with me because I still haven't filmed that yet and I'm going to hopefully film it later on in the day um because obviously like that needs to be done because I've still got so many questions unanswered and like I've come back I've got back into filming content throwing it at you like trying to be consistent with uploads and new content and things like that but I still haven't filmed that and that is important um and there's more sit down videos I want to do my mum's now getting into being in my videos again um so I'm really excited for that I've got questions for me and her to answer in a QA. and a um so I'll get sort of like some snacks and we'll have some wine and then we'll just answer those questions for you which I'm really excited for so there is plenty of new content coming when I see Malika um, in the summer we've got some exciting collaboration plans as well so you know it is all coming together but it's just it is still tough and I'm still trying to find ways to cope and I haven't found them yet so there's a high chance well there is a chance I'm going to be looking out potentially some counselling um slash like therapy so you know we'll see how that goes and I'll keep you in the loop because I like being honest I like being open that's one thing like I pride myself in and I surround my channel with honesty and being open because I don't find it being like you guys being invasive asking me questions because I know I've got quite a few viewers that suffer from anxiety or depression or any mental health illness um that ask me questions how I cope with it what I do and I feel like before I could answer it but now I can't and I'm not gonna full feed you false information um because I'm not like that so you know I've got ways that you may maybe I'll help you cope but there are no ways at the moment that are helping me cope um except obviously my family they are taking the edge off my friends and my boyfriend but mentally I've got no ways of coping so and that's only something I can change something that I can sort out which I'm going to do so yeah I need to go to the doctors because of my stomach which I'm going to talk about in a new in my life update get ready with me so keep your eyes peeled for that because all the questions you ask me over on my Instagram any questions you may be thinking of are going to be answered if you've got any other questions because you don't have me on Instagram I'll leave my Instagram in the description bar but if you want to leave some questions down below um because that'd be really good thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next vlog or video whichever one you watch first bye